Time Run. Rock stars and best friends. The bond that, that we have is like no other. Making music and having fun. These guys are on the fast track to the big time. Nobody had any idea it would be this big. Now they have a new album and a smoking new single. And tonight, we've got the world premiere of their brand new music video right here. This is Big Time Rush. Music sounds better with you. We're just filming each other. Yeah! Big Time Rush! because nobody else in the world understands what we're going through except for us four. We're like brothers. They're definitely my best friends. I basically uh, have three more brothers now, which are some of the best people that I've ever met in my life. People are like, do you fight a lot? And we're like, yeah, we do. We fight a lot. But there's one thing that we do more, and it's, it's laugh a lot. We keep each other entertained. Hey, here's a piece of wood that we just found lying on the ground. We're going to break it. Woohoo! Not that you guys weren't big before, but it's been amazing all over the world now. I think the reason that Big Time Rush is doing so well is because we really work our butts off. It's been seven days a week consistently for a few years now, but what that really teaches you is when you see your friends and family make the best of that time right then. It's hard to be away from your family. It's hard to be on the road all the time. Lack of sleep. <laughs> That's the worst thing on the road. Big Time Rush. <laughs> the only way to make this thing work is if we put our heart and souls into it, and I think that we're doing that. But I think this year was a really cool year for us because I saw a growth uh, within all four of us. So to be able to write about it and tell all the listeners what we've been going through is such a cool thing. We're just trying to create the best music we can and have as much fun as we can every day, and that seems to translate into uh, something our fans enjoy. And as long as our fans are having fun, we're going to keep making music and keep making TV shows. Turns out music does sound better with you. The fans are definitely the biggest inspiration, I and mean, there's no question. And that's why the guys love making music for the fans. So when the band isn't being mobbed by fans on the road, Crazy. how do they make time for fun? Each of us can only say one word. It has to form like the whole story. I really love BTR. <laughs> Find out when we come back with more great music and more up close and personal with the guys on Big Time Rush. Music sounds better with you. We're back with Big Time Rush. Music sounds better with you. It's time for some fun on the road with the guys. Big time road trip! We are about to go check out the sights. Let's go! Right. We have Buckingham Palace right here. I've never seen so many people carry swords before. I feel like such a tourist, and I like it. There should be some hooligans in here. And I'm pretty sure there's four of them. That's how you go! It's not how you go. Oh my God. I'm pretty sure those four hooligans make up a band called Big Time Rush. Oh, You're about to step onto the Big Time Rush tour bus. You ready? Oh, I'm ready. <laughs> this is both our living room and our kitchen. Yeah, it's really exciting. And no, it's never this clean. All right, so what everybody wants to see, what's in our fridge? Pizza rolls! Carrots. 
and fruit waffles. Who doesn't like waffles? One thing you can't go without on tour. Mochi ball. Mochi. So what the guys don't know That's is right. I drink out of the jug. Yeah, <laughs> okay. All right, guys, this is our bedroom. My bunk right back here. We got our, uh, our little TVs to swivel around right here. Maybe not everybody's so clean. Logan, welcome to the back lounge. Got a couple TVs, a little one there, a big one right there. Gaming system. Ah! Oh! <laughs> what are you doing in there, dude? You know, shaking out. Two essentials on the big time rush tour bus. The candy drawer. And secondly, and possibly more important, the toy gun arsenal. We're loading up right now. Say yeah, hello to my little friend. We also have bouncy balls. These being thrown inside the bus only create terrible times for all. They really hurt. I'm about to get crazy. This is big time gunfight. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, enjoy it. The guys definitely know how to have a good time, but for Kendall, James, Carlos, and Logan, it's always about the music. Um, I, just, I really want to just tell you that I, I really appreciate everything that, like, you know, you, you talk. Elevate a little higher. <laughs> if you want to party, you want to party. Elevate a little higher. Really? You can't beat him, join him. You can't beat us, you're gonna join us, all right? It's gonna be fun. Elevate a little higher. The new album is called Elevate. 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 With Big Time Rush? Right. The title kind of says it all. The music is elevated. It's bigger, it's better. We were much more hands-on. Eight of the 12 songs we all wrote, so it's pretty much Big Time Rush. Elevate is kind of like our little baby. The second one is going to blow up, I think. We're really excited for the fans to hear it. And everybody's going to have a good time listening to it. I know it. It's going to be awesome. Love me, love me, sing, gonna love me. I know you're ready to go. It's a whole other level for us. Uh, the second album took a much longer time to create. We spent late, late nights in the studio working on it and writing it. Uh, uh, all right, go again. Two of the vocal producers that we worked with a lot were Damon Sharp and Chris Rojas. And he's just amazing. He's got such an ear for harmonies and backgrounds and musical development. We worked our butts off in the studio in between filming and in between traveling. The label was so kind to get us a tour recording bus, which was the coolest thing ever. We'd wake up, I guess, around noon and barely be awake, you know, I'd brush my teeth and go straight to the studio. The entire back lounge had a vocal booth and then it had all the setup and all the gear. It was really cool to have that time where you can just make music, you know, 24-7. All the songs are so different. There's not, like, one sound. I think they're going to see a side of BTR that's much more mature and grown up. I really think it's a step in the right direction, and I can't wait to see what people think about it. I'm ready to go. What do you guys think? Like it? Coming up, never before seen, the world premiere of Music Sounds Better With You. Ah! I'm so excited. And we'll go behind the scenes as the guys take the stage. It's all coming your way when Big Time Rush, Music Sounds Better With You comes rocking back. We're back in minutes away from the world premiere of Music Sounds Better With You. But first, go behind the scenes with the guys as they prep for a live performance. It's gonna be a big, 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 big night. I'm so glad that we're doing 14 songs because that stage is definitely worthy of 14 songs. Well, on a performance day, we luckily don't have to wake up early, which is great. Oh! 
And uh, you know, we'll get lunch, we'll go to the venue. If we can sound check, we will. See, we're jumping up and down on that thing, and I think the keyboards would fall over, so they're gonna fix that. This is what sound check is for. Just to get levels and stuff, make sure you can hear everything. You know. This is my uh, wireless transmitter. Got a little rig here, so it straps to my back, so when I'm doing flips and stuff, it doesn't get in the way. And it connects to my in-ear monitors that are right here. And that means I can hear the band, hear what everybody's playing, hear the other guys sing. Sometimes it gets so loud between the screaming and the huge speaker stacks up there that you need these in order to be able to hear. It screws in, basically, because it's molded right to my ear. So, now I can't hear you. Sorry. It looks like you have some New Year's, too. Yeah, it looks like you have some New Year's. It's hey, interesting. Do. Let's see yours. Hey, what are you guys doing? Huh? What are you guys doing? Why are you yelling? I can't hear you because I got my ears in. I can literally hear Carlos peeing from my in-ears. He's got yeah. his mic in the bathroom. That's gross. Carlos, that's gross. Right now, we're about to sound check. Just go over a couple songs and see if uh, the mix is sound good, and then we'll be uh, ready for the show. Non-caffeine tea, I'm a really hyper person, so that would not be good. Hey, Kendall, can you do me a favor and not yeah. make Carlos tea and make me tea instead? Okay, seriously, what are you guys arguing about this time? Huh? Do you want a cup of tea? Yes. Like the three amigos. Four, four yeah. amigos, you got a problem. Four, three four, four tears, amigos. If you will, you know? <laughs> anyway, sorry about that. Sometimes <laughs> random people just walk into the dressing room. I mean, it's, it's strange, I know, but... Oh, uh, did sir, you need something? We... Did you need something? <laughs> Best friends, everybody! <laughs> Best friends, come on! Tea cheers to a great show. Tea cheers. Great show. Tea cheers. There we go. Great show. Huzzah, huzzah. I used to get butterflies all the way up until the show. Now it's just like the last two minutes before we go on stage. When we perform live, of course you get a rush. When you go on the stage and you're full of energy because the crowd is just, uh, it's amazing. Just thinking about all those people watching you, doing your thing, it kind of just gives you this adrenaline. Right before we go on, we'll like look out at the crowd and then be like, we get to do this together and have fun. Usually all of us end up coming up to each other, giving a hug and being like, I love you, dude. We all put our hands in and do the Mighty Ducks quack. Quack, 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 People do this was yeah. pretty crazy. We had a moment there. So everybody get up, up, out of your seats. Kick off your shoes like you're down at the beach. And jump up, up, up on the beach. Singing A-O, 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 up, up, out of your seats. Be who you are, love is all you need. I love is geeks, freaks, and wanna be. Singing A-O, if I rule the world. I would give it, give it all to you. Give it, give it, give it all to you. Quite literally, I would make everyone have a dance party at a certain time during the day. And everybody would just have to get up and just start dancing. Wait, dude, what time is it? Is it I'm like, oh, time to dance! immediate gratification of having hundreds or thousands or like Mexico 65,000 people screaming at you, you're gonna physically feel an energy. Thousands sounds like a lot, but what about 500,000? Well, that's how many fans it took to land Big Time Rush, their first gold record. It's pretty cool that the first album went gold. Mind blowing. Congratulations, here are your plaques. Nice. 
so cool to actually hold that album. Kendall and I exchanged a look, and I was like, dude, it's really happening. You know, and he, and he looked at me, and he was like, I know. <laughs> I was like, I don't know if I ever really thought I would ever get one of these. To actually have a gold album, like, on my wall in my house that has my name on it is so cool. And I know that my mom has one hanging in, in their house, so that was really cool. Um, this gold record is amazing. Thank you, guys, and thank you to all the fans. To see the other places where people were responding so well, the album was such a, a blessing. Well, I'm hoping that with this next album we can get a platinum record. It would be really great. Really great. And now their new album is going to elevate them to the next level. But first, they'll have to smile for the camera. The album photo shoot was really cool. We were very much hands-on and what we wanted to get out of the photo shoot and how we want to look. On the album cover, we're actually uh, levitating, elevating. Da -da -da. <laughs> It was a day full of shooting in New York, and uh, we basically just kind of ran around the city and, and took the coolest pictures everywhere. In fact, I think the artwork in the album is even cooler than the cover. So people really get to see a lot of different photos and a lot of different fun ideas that we had conceptually thought of for the cover at first, and we put those all in the interior. We worked with Michael Miller which is really cool. Uh, he's, he's a legend. He captured these images kind of mid-air and as we went up, so everybody just looks like they're floating. It looks very natural, and I think it turned out pretty cool. Yeah, we're super happy how it came out. When we come back, the moment you've all been waiting for. The world premiere of a brand new music video, Music Sounds Better With You. We're in the final countdown to the world premiere of Music Sounds Better With You from Big Time Rush. But first, let's go on the set for an exclusive look at the making of the video. Right now, we are in the set of our music video for our song, Music Sounds Better With You, which is our first single off of Elevate. The video for Music Sounds Better With You um, is pretty crazy. It is very up-tempo and really exciting. And to have Man on the track, is, it, it adds like just that extra little bonus. This is Man right here, superstar. Man. man, man, hey, what can we say? He's the I just man. Yes. Man is the man. These are my new brothers, so every time you see me, you see them. They part of the birthday gang. They live every day like it's their birthday. There we go. He's doing an awesome feature on our song, and he looks great in the video. Yo, he's got swag, right? Dude has gold, gold teeth, like legit gold. Working with Big Time Rush has definitely been a great experience. You know, them dudes are funny. That's if he were a vampire, he'd be a rich vampire. Oh, they're my bros, man. They're my brothers. So shout out to Big Time Rush. We have an amazing director, uh, Mark Klasfeld, who's done everything. The premise of this music video is just fun. And we have a huge party going at Warehouse, which this warehouse is sick. It's pretty awesome. Shout out to all the break dancers. Oh. They did their thing. You know what I'm saying? This, I is, this is what I got. There you go. There you go. That's all I got. We have some pretty, pretty, pretty ladies. How'd you think about our scene? It was awesome. I think it's pretty it good. Such a blast. It was really cool. Um, <laughs> so we had some really cool moments, and I'm super psyched for the rest of the day. I don't know about you. I'm so excited. What. We have some of the coolest choreography that I think we've ever done. It's a partner dance, almost like a modern tango. The dance was definitely uh, hard to learn. We spent about eight hours on the dance, and uh, we worked our butts off. I think that uh, the fans are going to be very impressed with our dancing. Things get so bad, you've got my back. Make me want to say. I think the most important thing is to have fun. And that's what we're doing, and hopefully it uh, comes across on camera. This music video is gonna rock. I cannot wait for you guys to see the finished product. It's gonna be sick. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for. This is our brand new music video for Music Sounds Better With You. Check it out. Better with you. Better with you, yeah. I try to write this down. The words just don't come out. It's hard to say how you
Thank you so much for checking out our music video premiere for Music Sounds Better with You. You know what they say. That's, That's a wrap! Woo! Thanks for hanging out with us. We hope to see you soon. Later, you guys. Nickelodeon.